Hello everyone and welcome to another video where I'm showing my big Pokemon binder collection. We've covered the first two generations of Pokemon and after that my amount of species and cards declines considerably. So actually in this binder I will have generation 3 Pokemon which I still grew up with and played with a lot and collected but also generation 4 and 5 I think will be in this binder. And I'm showing these binders because I am accepting offers for the binders. If someone is interested, just let me know as a comment or as a message on YouTube. And yeah, I, I kind of need uh, some money uh, for personal reasons that I've mentioned in another video. And I thought, you know, as much as I like the cards, I need the money more, so... I should let the cards maybe go for someone that would appreciate it more than me that I'm worried about money issues at the moment. Anyway, enough with the sad stuff. Let's look at let's look at and appreciate the art of these different cards. I will be mentioning if I have a particularly bad quality card, but that was more in the other binders, I think. And of course the language because it might not be no so clear for you with the quality of my camera if you can see the language. But so far, for Trico, we can see this one is English, Japanese English, English, go well here, you have English. As you can see, I'm missing the third evolution, so I never was able to finish that. Then Torchic, I have English, Spanish, and Japanese. Then the evolutions, I have here Japanese, English, and Japanese hollow. Mudkip, I have here an English, sorry, a Japanese hollow. Very nice one. Uh, English reverse hollow. And then Marsh Tomb, I have uh, English normal cart. Now here, I have some more languages. So this Puccina is in uh, Spanish. This one is a hollow Portuguese card. This one is Spanish. Spanish, English, English, Japanese, English, English reverse hollow with the, the nice uh, grass pattern here. Here I have Japanese. Now this floor evolution is in Korean. This one is Japanese and it's a bit hollow. Japanese, English, English. This one is a Russian, um, yeah, reverse hollow, also with the, the pattern here of the symbol, the colorless symbol. Russian, but non reverse hollow. Russian. Then you have here English, English, English. Portuguese, English, English. Spanish, English, Japanese. It's a very multilingual collection, what I have, you can see. English, Japanese, English, 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 Spanish, English, Japanese, Spanish, Japanese, English, hollow, you can see, and it doesn't look a very bad condition. Then you have Japanese, hollow also, uh, English, English, Spanish, English, English. And some of these names I don't remember so well anymore, so I'll be skipping that. This is a hollow uh, Japanese, Portuguese. This is probably my worst condition card, and it's in Portuguese. I might just throw this away, actually, but I don't know why I kept it. Uh, because you can see here how bad this is. I don't. If, I think I might have found it somewhere, and I didn't have the card, so I decided to, to keep it. But this is just horrible, really. Anyway, <laughs> I guess it, it serves as a reminder of what can happen to a card if you don't treat it well. English, Spanish, English, English, Russian, and Russian also. English, Sableye, then you have Russian and Japanese, and this one, okay, just one here. English, Japanese. Aaron, I have here Spanish, reverse hollow, English, 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 reverse hollow, 
let's see, this one is Spanish, but I have also, okay, Spanish that's not reverse hollow, Spanish, English, um, Portuguese, reverse hollow, Portuguese, reverse hollow, and then one of my favorite species of this generation is Minan and Puzzle. So you have here Japanese hollow, uh, English, Japanese, Japanese. There is one here where they have the other perspective. One is in the plane and the other one is in the runway. Japanese, Japanese. Here you have reverse hollow and there's something else here, which is non-reverse hollow exactly. Japanese hollow for puzzle. Uh, here's the other perspective I was talking about. All of these are in Japanese except this one, which is in English. And this one is especially fun. They're bumping uh, their butts together. Then here I have Volbeat, uh, reverse hollow Russian, and then non-reverse hollow Russian, English, Russian, Japanese, and probably English also I have here. Yes. Japanese. Here I have Spanish Carvana. And here is reverse hollow English and non reverse hollow. Then I have Sharpedo here, a reverse hollow and non reverse hollow. But these two, this one is in Portuguese and this one is in Spanish. So that's uh, interesting. English, Japanese. This is a hollow Spanish Waylord. This one is in English. English, 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 Japanese, English, Russian, Russian, English, Japanese, English, Japanese, Japanese. Then you have here, all of these are in English, this one is a hollow. English, English, Russian, Japanese, Russian, Japanese. English, 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 Japanese, Japanese, Japanese. So all of these are pretty common playable cards, as you can see. We have here the Japanese GX Full Art. English, uh, Japanese, English, English, Japanese. Japanese, English, English. Going through these a bit fast, but as you can see, there's a lot of Pokemon. Japanese, Japanese, English. And I used to play with these cards, I think. They don't look so bad. I used to have them in the deck. Okay, maybe this one has a bit of a an issue, but overall, I played with this still. English, 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 Japanese. English, English, Japanese. Oh, yeah, I remember this was this one was in my deck. English, English, English. English and English. And now to another one of my favorite species, it's Latios and Latias. Here you can see it's a non-hollow Japanese Latios. This one is Japanese and hollow. Kind of full art, Japanese also hollow. This one is a hollow uh, English. This one is Japanese non-hollow. This one is a hollow Latias English from 2004. So it even has, I don't know what set that is, but the, the set symbol is Latias itself. Then this one is hollow in Japanese. This one is kind of full art English Latias. And this one is the more recent, beautiful artwork of both of them together. Brother and sister making a little heart shape. This one is in Japanese. And I have here another one of them flying together in Japanese. And another one of my favorite species is Kyogre, and I have a few of them here. Both of these are hollow Japanese EX. You have here, oops, sorry about that, technical problems. But you have here full art English Kyogre EX hollow, primal Kyogre EX hollow with some Japanese text here. Kyogre EX also beautiful hollow with the the outlines here highlighted in English. Another Primal Kyogre EX in English with a Japanese text. This Kyogre and the uh, Grudon I will show you soon is in French. So it actually has several Pokemon and a trainer. Uh, here you have another Primal Kyogre EX in English. The Grudon EX that I was talking about also is in French. 
So those two were in French. Rayquaza here, I have English Hollow. Rayquaza C, level X, English Hollow. Mega Rayquaza, English Hollow with their Japanese text. Jirachi is also one of my favorite species. This one was the first one I got. So English Hollow, you can see. Then I really got this, I like the artwork on this one a lot, so I got it, of course. But this one is in Italian, but it's also a hollow. Then you have another hollow, but this one is in Japanese. And finally, for the Gen 3, we still have some Jirachis to go through. So this one is in English, and that's a beautiful hollow. I don't know if you can see very well, but both here, he, the flying makes a heart shape, and then you have like the road here, also as a hollow. This one is a non-hollow, um, Japanese, English, Shining Jirachi, very beautiful full art Jirachi here in English. And Deoxys here, I have possibly one of the weirdest cards ever made, which is the Lenticular Deoxys. So, as you can see, or maybe not, let me see if I can get this. Yeah, you can see here when you move it, it actually has a different artwork and text here, and attack. So this is actually a very thick card. It's a very decent condition, the one I got in. It's quite rare, but you can still find it sometimes for sale. But yeah, you can see it's uh, thicker than usual. And it's much more sturdy also, it doesn't bend so easily, because it has plastic. And, but it still fits nicely in the binder, so it doesn't really, that's not an issue. I have here some Japanese on Hollow Deoxys EX, some Deoxys EX Deoxys Hollow English, and finally the Delta Species Electric Type Hollow Deoxys in English. Okay, so that's Gen 3. Now, from now on, the other gens I have are. I mean, they're even more incomplete, so you have to bear with me. Not only are they incomplete, but um, they might be in different languages. And I probably did not play with them, so at least they are in a bit better condition. But you have here... I, I won't bother to say the names because I don't know them very well, so I'll just tell you the languages and any other special things. So English, this one is in Portuguese, English... This one is a hollow, but it is in Portuguese. This one is a hollow, but it is in English, Japanese, Spanish, uh, English. No, sorry, this one is in Portuguese. Then we have Japanese, Japanese hollow. There you go. Uh, English, English, Portuguese, Russian, 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 Japanese. Japanese, 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 Portuguese, hollow, um, English, hollow, English, 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 English. Then English, English, Japanese, English, English, Japanese, 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 and English. Then Portuguese, Portuguese, English, Japanese, English, reverse hollow, and English here. English, English, Japanese, Japanese, English reverse hollow and probably the non reverse hollow as well. English, English, English and uh, possibly Japan, no, sorry, Japanese and English. I have here reverse, I have the Japanese, I have the English reverse hollow and the English non reverse hollow. Then also English. This is a Japanese promo, yeah, exactly, of Weevil, so it's a hollow, this one is English hollow, this one is uh, Japanese, and then hollow Magnezone English, Russian, this is the Rhydon Evolution, I don't know the name, but this one is reverse hollow, but it's Russian, English, English, Oregon Z, English, kind of full art, Japanese, English hollow, Japanese, Uxi, reverse hollow, Mesprit, that's not just English, so these are English, 
in the bottom here. Then some uh, more exciting ones perhaps for you will be these Dialga GXs, which are all full art and uh, very nice. I don't know the technical term for this type of rarity, but you can see here. These are all in English and also these ones. This is a reverse hollow. This is just a hollow. But some of these are some of these are that special, more silvery type of rarity that I don't know the name exactly right now. And then you have here also a Memphi Hollow English, more than one. And then Japanese Hollow English Full Art and this Arceus Hollow as well with this special symbol. So that was Generation 4 and I believe this might be Generation 5. Again, I really dropped off Pokemon after Generation 3, so this is way out of my comfort zone. But Japanese, Russian, English, Japanese, uh, Russian, English, uh, Russian. Japanese, English, uh, Russian, <laughs> English, English, Reverse Hollow Russian, Reverse Hollow Russian, and probably the other one as well, yep. English and Russian. English, Russian, English, English, Russian, English. All of these are English. And you have here an English hollow. English, English, Japanese, Japanese, Russian, reverse hollow, Russian, Russian, Japanese. And the last page of this binder, we have Japanese, English, you see here, English, English, Reverse Hollow English, Japanese, English, and finally, these two are in Russian. So thank you for watching. Uh, we have, I think, only one more, two, two more binders to go through. I think the next one is the last one with actual Pokemon. And then the final binder will be with trainer cards, which I have a big collection of as well. So again, I am accepting offers for the binders. Uh, in this case, if you are interested in... Because I only accept offers for the other generations as a complete offer. So if you want the first generation binders, you have to get all of them. If you want the second gen, you can get all of them. This one, because it's much more or less complete, I can still offer only the third gen complete. And I will take these away, the other, the other ones. Or if you just want everything, you can also feel free to make an offer on that. But at the very least, I hope that as you are watching this, you are appreciating the art and the different Pokemons, the artists that have made all of these cards. But yeah, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video.